What's happening, everybody? Welcome back. This is Four Goal. And today we're going to be comparing the Athena set versus the Rugal set banner that we previously got during the Rugal banner to see which of these sets is actually better. And we're going to be testing this using Rugal. And I can pretty much assure you guys, whatever the outcome happens to, in today's video, you can pretty much bet that for Athena and Lady Chen, whatever set wins is going to be stronger on those characters. But let's take a look at what we got going on here with the Athena set. So the Athena set increases the extreme fire critical rate by seven percent so does the rugal set it does the exact same thing which is really really nice increases yellow and relevant fighters uh, 30 by th cp by thirty thousand, which doesn't matter for rugal at all and really doesn't matter for damage in all reality guys it's all about attack and the buffs that you get during your attack and then we have the 30 percent chance to charge five power slots which the rugal set also has but the interesting thing about interesting thing about this set versus the Rugal set is this set increased critical damage by five percent every time Extreme Ladder Fighter lands a critical hit, max twenty attack stacks, which means you can gain up to hundred percent critical damage. You don't always have hundred percent critical damage, but you can gain up to that point. And then whenever you do reach maximum stacks, you increase your critical rate by ten percent, which means you're going to do more critical hits, which means more damage. And then this is the exact same increased Extreme Fighter attack by twenty-three percent for every one power. That's exactly the same as the Rugal set as we'll take a look at here in a second as long as i can find this set it's always fun you know going through these sets and trying to find uh where the particular sets are at that i'm looking for there it is okay so the first one again seven percent critical rate right and then you know the 30 percent power charge rate but here's the difference this always has an increased critical damage by 70 percent it's always up all the time and deals an additional damage equal to 250 percent of attack upon landing an active skill which the athena set doesn't have it also increases the extreme fighter attack by 22 percent per every one power which is exactly the same as the athena set so guild ray is going to be resetting here really soon so i'm just going to show you guys this really really quick now i'm going to be using rugal's leadership because we're just going to be doing a solo okay Rugal's leadership does give the critical rate by 10%, which does help. And we do have the Athena set on them, and we do have the Shermie option card and the Zhang Fei option card. So that way we can apply both dots. That way we can break the meter against Guild Raid Nightmare Geese. So let's see how this goes. Okay, okay. And then, you know, there's always going to be variables, guys, in our runs. But, uh... All right, we're going to go ahead and do that 3PG... Let's go, let's go, okay? Now, I'm just going to run this for about one minute. Oh, yeah. It doesn't take long, guys. Perfect. Okay. There we go. Now, we really don't want that darkness to get on the ground. We want to try to avoid that at all costs. So, depending on my run, depends on how well we do with that. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. It also depends as long as that first skill resets. That makes a big difference also in our damage. Nice, nice, nice. Now, I think Geese might go into an iframe right now. We'll see. And I'm just, you know, in this video, guys, I'm just jumping right into it. And... Nice. Let's go. Doing really good so far. I'll be able to go straight into my skills afterwards. Nice. And we want to stop at one minute. So about 15.8 billion, guys, about 15.8 billion. So let's slap on the Rugal set and see what happens as far as that goes, right? 15.8 billion is the score to beat. Can we beat it with the Rugal set? Well, let's find out. Let's find out. Now, something I really do like that they've changed recently with these card sets is that once you equip one certain card on a character, then it automatically will bring up the cards up here in the top left-hand corner, which is nice. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And again, guys, there's always going to be variables in these runs, but it will give you an idea. I've tested this quite a bit, and I pretty much get the same outcome every time, but you never know. Well, you never know. We'll see, we'll see. 
And remember, this is a solo, okay? I've also tested this using a team. Okay. Boom. All right. Okay, we're just going to go straight in at 3PG, just like we did a second ago. We're trying to play the exact same way if I can. Oh, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. All right. And I think you guys are going to find that... There, I think you're going to find that there isn't a tremendous difference between them. I mean, there's a little bit, but not a tremendous difference. Nice, nice. Now there we have darkness applied on the ground. That actually kind of sucks. We're going to try to hit our guard. There we go. Nice. Perfect, perfect. We don't want that darkness to come down again because we've got a 30 second cooldown on that heal. That is, we definitely don't want that. And... Okay. Damn it, that darkness applied just a little, I mean, if it would just been a little bit longer, man. But I think we've, I think we've kind of, we've waited that 30 seconds. Okay, guys, so we actually went over the limit and it's at 14.6, right? We went like eight seconds over. I got a little overzealous there. But as you guys can see, the new set, the Athena set is doing more damage, right? And whether I did this with a team or whether I did this, you know, doing a solo, this is the outcome that I'm getting. But it's not by a massive margin, guys. I mean, what do we do? Like maybe a billion more damage with the Athena set? I mean, that's a good amount, but it's not insane. It's not over the top. It's not ridiculous. It's not, you know, massive. Now, let me show you guys um, how much damage we're actually going to do. And uh, let's see, Dungeon Trials. Let's try this, okay? So we're going to go ahead and change one of these option cards, okay? We're going to go ahead, because all we need is really cold damage at the very beginning. So we're going to change this card, and we're going to put on this other option card that actually increases critical damage. And uh, this might be, might be pretty fun for you guys, okay? Now what I'm going to do, guys, is when there's about four seconds left on the Awakened skill, I'm going to start going through my skills and start spamming, okay? You'll, you'll get the drift of what I'm doing here. You'll see exactly what I'm doing. I'm going to do it the exact same way for both of these runs, all right? But I mean, 1 billion more damage in guild rate in one minute isn't really that much. It's not some massive amount. It might be a little bit more, but it's not by a whole lot, guys. All right, so we're just going to go 2, 3, and then we're going to hit that one skill now. And... Boom, right? Now that was at 2 minutes and 10 seconds. 2 minutes and 10 seconds. I know, Rugal just does so much damn damage. It's like, it's really hard to see, right? But it was 2 minutes and 10 seconds. So let's see uh, how this goes, okay? So let's slap on the Athena set and try that, right? I mean, that's just nuts, by the way, guys. That damage is just, it's freaking bonkers, okay? So let me slap on the Athena here. And I know some of you are thinking, well, yeah, but I mean, he just maxed out the score. It's kind of like, I mean, that's pretty, that's pretty nuts in itself, right? That's pretty nuts. But that's why I said two minutes and 10 seconds, he actually did it. Okay, now I'm going to try to play it exactly the same way as I did the first time. And, you know, we really have reached the point where characters are just so strong that it can't, it can't be hard to tell sometimes. That's why we did the guild raid run. So again, four seconds left. We'll do the same thing. And here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. 
And there we go. Now that was about two minutes and 11 seconds. If you guys paid attention, it was just a little bit faster, right? It was just a little bit faster. I mean, I know it showed two minutes and 10, but when he actually cleared Spider Robot and hit that 2.1 billion, it was about two minutes and 11 seconds. So it is a little bit stronger. It is a little bit better than the Rugal set, but it's not by a massive margin, guys. It's not destroying it. It's not, you know, uh, ob obliterating it. It's a, I mean, it's better for sure. It's a better set. And whenever I did my team composition runs in Gilray, like whenever I do use Athena, Lady Chin and Rugal, or, you know, say Kusanagi and Lady Mary and Rugal, the same outcome, guys. I would get more damage with the Athena set, but it wasn't by a massive margin. It wasn't by a massive margin. And the thing about the Athena set is that I believe, and I could be wrong, but I believe this critical damage resets every time you tag the character in. Whereas when you're doing a solo and when you keep the character in there the whole time, it once you max it out, it stays maxed out. I think that's how it's working out, but I'm not 100% sure about it. But what I do know is from all the testing that I've done, this set is the best it's not the best though by very much so for those of you that had the rugal set i don't really think it's worth pulling for because it's i mean obviously if you want to get more cp for your yellow and red fighters it's all good but when you look at the cp guys like uh i mean if i go to a yellow and red fighter let me see let me find a yellow fighter here let's go to ryu right and let's slap that athena set on him okay let's just see the cp difference okay so we'll put the athena on him and we'll, we'll, we'll use, we'll do this versus the Rugal set and see what the difference is. Okay. Slap that on. All right. And we're just going to take that card off of them. Now we have 130,000 CP. We got 130,000 CP right now. Let's see what the Rugal set puts on them. Okay. So we'll go down to the Rugal. Okay. And 146,000. So the Rugal set, guys, like the damage isn't quite as high as the Athena set, but you're still, even on a yellow fighter, guys, even on a, a fighter that the Athena set busts up to 30,000 CP, the Rugal set still offers way more CP. It still offers way more CP, which is really, really good. And since the damage isn't far off from the Athena set, I think that if you already have the Rugal set, you probably don't, I mean, you probably don't need to pull for the Athena set. I mean, if you want to scrape those extra numbers, you want to get a little bit higher numbers, then it would be worth, worth pulling for. And if you don't have the Rugal set, right? You don't have the Rugal set. You don't have like, uh, you know, a certain EX set, like uh, like this set right here. This is also a really insane set for EX fighters. If you don't have this set, then the Athena set's going to be worth pulling for, especially for the yellow fighters, uh, yellow and red fighters, because it's going to bump up their CP. Man, it's going to make them a lot stronger. But this set here really is, in my opinion, just more well-rounded. It just offers more CP. The damage is very consistent. I mean, the Athena says damage is very consistent too. But again, the damage just, there isn't a lot of difference in the damage between the two sets. It's just not, it's not a massive amount. A little bit, but again, I mean, Athena, a little bit stronger. The Rugal set, a little bit more CP and almost as strong as the Athena set. So I guess depending on your perception, guys, depends on, you know, what you actually think is better. But if you already have this Rugal set, you already got a couple of Rugal sets, I don't think there's really a need to pull for the Athena set, at least in my humble opinion. Maybe if I tested on other characters, maybe I'd have a different outcome. And I'm pretty sure that the Athena set will be much better on Athena and Lady Chin because the more you bump up critical damage, the more physical damage you're actually gaining. So for those characters, there might be a much bigger difference and we will be testing that in the future. But this video has been long enough as it is, guys. Let me know what you think about the Athena set versus the Rugal set. And I do stream on Twitch at 9 p.m. GD plus 7 time. The link is in the description below. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Y'all take care and have a good one. See everybody.